The door of God's grace is beginning to close, my friends. God is offering mercy and salvation through His Son, Jesus Christ. But we must be willing to come to the Lord. We must be willing to repent. Because there is a time of judgment coming for you, sir. You're going to stand before God. Make sure your heart is right with the Lord. Repent and believe the gospel. Repent and turn to the Lord Jesus Christ. Repent and come to the mercy seat of God while there is still time. Because time is running out. And today while you are still alive, you have a chance to come to the Lord. But you must be willing to humble yourself. You must humble yourself and come and lay hold of this precious gift of salvation that God is offering through His Son, Jesus. But you must be willing to put down your pride. God is calling all men everywhere to repent because He has appointed a day of judgment where He is going to judge the entire world in righteousness through His Son, Jesus. There is a day of accountability, my friends, where you will all give an account to the God that has created you. And without the saving grace that comes through the sacrifice of God's Son, Jesus Christ, you are going to be judged as a sinner and you are going to go to hell. And hell awaits all those who die without the salvation of the Lord. And the good news is that God sent His Son, Jesus, to lay His life down on the cross for our sins. He was tortured. He shed His blood so that we can find redemption. Jesus Christ, He died, He laid down His life on the cross, and He was resurrected so that we can find salvation for our souls. But we must be willing to repent. We must be willing to turn away from our sinful lives and turn to Jesus. Save yourself from this wicked and perverse generation and come to the Lord. Be ye reconciled to God through the sacrifice of His Son, Jesus. Be ye reconciled to God through the sacrifice of His Son, Jesus Christ. Come to the Lord while there is still time, Knoxville, Tennessee, because judgment is coming. God is going to judge each and every soul in righteousness through His Son, Jesus. You must repent. If not, you're going to face the judgment for your sins. You're going to die without salvation and you're going to go to hell. And today I am pleading with you today, Knoxville, Tennessee, to repent. Get right with the Lord before it's too late. What is it that you gain all the things of this world, that you profit in this life only to lose your soul to hell? What is it that you live your life comfortable, living your life without the salvation of God only to die and face the judgment for your sins? Because you choose to live a godless life. You choose to reject the salvation of God. You choose to reject God's way of salvation, which is Jesus. Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. And no one can come to the Father except through Him. Your good works will not get you right with God. Your good works will not get you into the kingdom of heaven. Your good works is like filthy rags in the sight of a holy and righteous God. You must repent and believe in His Son, Jesus. For he who believes has everlasting life. But he who does not believe in the Son shall not see life. But the wrath of God abides upon them. That means without the saving grace that comes through Jesus Christ. The wrath of God abides upon you and when you die, you will face the judgment for your sin. There is a judgment over the world because of rebellion. There is a judgment over the souls 
of humanity because of sin. For all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. For all have sinned and broken God's law. And we are all in need of a Savior. We are all in need to come to God and get things right. If not, my friends, you're going to die and you're going to be judged for your sin. For it is appointed once for man to die, and then after that, the judgment. It is appointed once for you to die, and then after that, you will be judged by God. It is appointed for you once to breathe your last breath, and to step out of this world, and to step into eternity to be judged by God. And my friends, I am pleading with you today to come to the Lord Jesus while you are still alive. To lay hold of this precious gift of salvation that God is offering through His Son, Jesus. Come to the Lord while you are still alive because time is running out. You're not promised another day. Lay hold of the mercy seat of God while you are still alive. Repent and come to Jesus Christ. Repent and believe the gospel. Be ye reconciled to God today through the sacrifice of His Son, for judgment is coming, my friends. And if you die without salvation, you're going to go to hell. And there's a lot of people in this generation that are living a life apart from the salvation of God. And when you die without salvation, sir, you go to hell. Get right with God before it's too late. Time is running out, Knoxville, Tennessee. It's time to get right with God. Judgment is in the land. Repent and believe the gospel. Repent and turn to the Lord before it's too late because judgment day is coming for all of us. Repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. You gotta stop and you gotta leave the parking lot. Yes, ma'am. I understand that. Um, Ma'am, I just want to say, you know, we need to make sure our hearts are right with God. Look, I love people. God changed my life. He radically changed my life, brought me out of a life of drug addiction, alcoholism. I was in and out of jail. 2010, I had an encounter with God. I got into a broken place and I cried out on Jesus. I had no other place to go. And the Lord radically changed me. The Bible says, anyone who calls on the name of the Lord shall be saved. And all I'm saying as a testimony today, ma'am, Jesus Christ, we will stand before him and we will give an account to him when we die. So all I'm saying is, please, before you die, please consider this. This is the most important thing in life. And when you look out at everybody, it's the most neglected thing. They get caught up in the right. things of this yeah. world, the cares of life, and they neglect it. So please repent and believe the gospel. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. See, that's a testimony. God bless y'all. Please get right with God. Because if not, you're going to go to hell. You're going to be judged for your sin. That's the seriousness of the blood of Jesus, ma'am. Yes. We're, we're okay with y'all doing that off our yeah, property, though. So you property. just got to get off the property. Yeah. Just okay. make sure. Be convicted of your sins because we all sin. We need salvation. God bless y'all.